Now in today's legislative news, a bill to stop taxing districts from quickly rerunning a failed bond has passed the Idaho House. The effort is to stop local government entities from redoing a bond election right after voters deny it the first time. The bill would require they wait 11 months to try again. It would apply to all municipalities, but is mostly targeted at school districts. The bill drew bipartisan opposition. This bill is good because it incentivizes that careful consideration, getting community input, figuring out what the best proposal is and what the most likely one is, or what, what the most likely one to succeed is. And so it creates good incentives all the way around and it fosters more input and more transparency. I don't believe that 35 or 39 percent of the voters saying no is a persuasive enough reason to take this last tool away from districts. Let's get serious, like the good lady said here, and have a more difficult conversation about making our school boards and our taxing districts whole so that they are not in the position where they have to continually run bonds. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. This bill now heads to the Senate for debate.